Leicester boss Matt O'Connor blasted the decision to cite Manu Delaghi after his England centre was cleared of dangerous play. A day after match citing Commissioner Jeff Mark deemed Delaghi's tackle to be worthy of a red card, an independent disciplinary committee disagreed. It means Delaghi is free to take on Saracens this Sunday, but Tigers are mighty miffed at the unnecessary disruption caused to their star man. It's what it does to Manu in the state that he's in, said O'Connor. He comes back and plays the game physically and legally. It makes everyone unnecessarily cautious about the physicality and collisions. The sanction has to be a red card offence and from our perspective it was not. There was no malice, there was no intent to hurt the bloke. It was a very legitimate tackle. The decision to cite was widely condemned by pros and ex-players alike including British and Irish Lions teammate Brian O'Driscoll. I think the game has gone soft if we're picking up on marginal collisions like the Manu Delaghi tackle he's been cited for, former Ireland captain O'Driscoll said on Twitter. O'Connor believes it was a reaction to the broader community around health and safety and player welfare. He added, everyone involved in the game has to be a little bit more accountable for the actions they take. The players and the coaches certainly are and we'd like the rest of rugby to be just as accountable. The citing commissioners need to be a little bit more accurate with what they're sanctioning and what they're not. An independent tribunal heard evidence and submissions from, amongst others, Delaghi, who pleaded not guilty to the offence in what was his first match back from a three-month injury layoff. The three-strong panel found that he had committed a reckless act of foul play in that his shoulder had made contact with the head of Munster flanker Chris Cloet in a Champions Cup match. But they were not satisfied that the offence had warranted a red card and dismissed the complaint.